video shows the magnitude and timing of that deadly 7.8 earthquake that hit Turkey and Syria. Closed caption, closed uh, circuit TV, I should say. Footage shows uh, inside a shop as that earthquake struck. You just saw a bunch of things rattling, falling from the shelves as the quake shook that shop. The powerful quake rocked wide areas of Turkey and Syria, toppling a bunch of buildings, killing thousands of people, at least 3,000 at, at this latest count. Hundreds more still believed to be trapped under rubble, and the toll is expected to rise as rescue workers search mounds of wreckage in cities and towns across that area. Okay. And today we also spoke to a geologist from San Diego State to help us understand the power of the earthquake and why the death toll specifically is so high. And Dr. Tom Rockwell said that the earthquake was similar with what we can see along the San Andreas Fault, but that structures in Turkey and Syria just don't have the capacity to handle a quake of that magnitude. You ask why there was so much damage. Uh, two reasons. One, a lot of this is rural areas and the building codes are not up to California standards. And that's probably one of the biggest reasons. Uh, and then there's a lot of older structures as well that are just uh, not at all suitable for earthquakes. He also said that there is a universal building code, but not all developers in Turkey or Syria necessarily follow it. And that they haven't put in an early warning system like we have here in California, but probably wouldn't have made a difference at the epicenter of that quake.